It's Wednesday, July 29th, 2015. Good morning, I'm forecaster Mark Spencer from NeoWeather.com. A hot and a humid day in store today with highs around 90. We'll see scattered storms this evening and for part of your overnight, we'll take a look at our future cast. And we have a summer-like forecast, but how long will these warm temperatures last? I have all the details on that and more coming up in just a moment. Lots of sun and uh, comfortably warm out there right now this morning. We are looking off to the west. We do see some clouds and a few rain showers. Fortunately, this is all diminishing. Uh, we will see clouds increase later today, however, with a chance for showers and storms this evening. We'll take a look at the future cast in just a moment. Taking a look across the rest of the country this morning, uh, we'll have a weak cold front come through, and that's going to be associated with this rain out here, but this rain out here is not going to affect us. It's going to move off to the south and east, pretty much miss much of Ohio. Uh, otherwise, fairly quiet across the rest of the country. There are some showers and a few thunderstorms across parts of the southwestern United States and also across parts of Florida. Otherwise, a wonderful start to a good majority of the country. Temperatures across the area this morning, again, comfortably warm, generally in the uh, middle 60s along the Lakeshore, Port Clinton, the exception at 75, or at 66 in Cleveland and Ashtabula, 71 in Akron's our inland warm spot this morning. Youngstown's at 65, 62 Worcester, 68 Mansfield, and 66 for Dover, New Philadelphia. Temperatures are going to get quite warm today when we're going to hit 90, maybe a little bit better in a couple spots as well. Our almanac for today, yesterday's high, 89 degrees, the low 65, just one shy of 90. Our averages are 82 and 64, respectively. The record high, 95 today. We're not going to get close to that, I don't believe. So uh, that record should stand. No rain yesterday. Sunrise is at 619 a.m. and sunset is at 848 p.m. On our future cast, we're going to watch some storms off to the west develop later this afternoon. Right around 4 or 5 o'clock, they develop around Toledo and move through this evening. And by about 2 2 a.m. they are off to the east and that's going to give us a nice Thursday. Here we are about 2 o'clock in the afternoon with plenty of sun around. Not everybody will see rain but uh, there will be scattered storms around this evening so if you are heading out you may want to keep the umbrella handy for a short time. On our hour-by-hour hour forecast here, you can see the heat really building quickly. By 11 o'clock, we're already in the lower 80s, high 80s by lunchtime, 90 by 3 p.m. A few places could do a degree or two better than that, and we'll stay warm through the evening with a few storms off to the west around 7 o'clock this evening. Our forecast for today, let's go with a high of 90 for the Cleveland metro area. Again, hot and a little humid, but it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, clouds will increase later this afternoon with temperatures quickly rising into the 80s this morning. Akron and Canton, I'm going to go 92 here. Uh, we're starting a little warm here already, so let's go with 92. Clouds will increase after 5 o'clock, I believe. It'll be a little bit later here compared to Cleveland. And uh, still, again, a very hot and uh, a little humid day as well. If we're headed to the Tribe game. It's going to be a sunny and a hot one. I think by the end of the game, we'll be right around 90 as that's going to end right around uh, the peak heating time for the day, 3, 4 o'clock. Uh, we play the Royals again, and uh, boy, I hope we can at least bring one win home to the uh, to the park because uh, we're not doing too good, folks. So uh, let's hope they can turn it around today and maybe get a little momentum going at home. Uh, overnight tonight, we're looking at storms to the west around 7, then scattered storms roughly through about midnight or so. They'll linger off to the east for a little bit longer than that. Otherwise, we will gradually clear out through the latter half of the evening with lows right around 68 not our seven day forecast really looking nice here but a little unsettled let's go with 84 and lots of sun for your thursday friday not looking bad either an isolated storm however models not exactly uh in great agreement on that so we'll have to watch that closely otherwise highs in the mid 80s perhaps a chance of an isolated storm early on friday otherwise the night will be dry scattered storms on saturday primarily in the afternoon Sunday is going to be the pick day of the weekend with partly cloudy skies, highs in the lower 80s. As we get into next week, we really get unsettled, and you'll notice in later forecasts the temperature beginning to decline. 
Yeah, how about 80, maybe upper 70s for highs as we hit the second half of next week. We do have a chance for scattered storms as well to start your week off. Right now, highs look to be in the lower and middle 80s. Be sure to stay tuned to NeoWeather.com for the very latest.